Here we go. It's happening the first mega trade of the offseason 2022 between the Minnesota Wild and the Los Angeles King. The Minnesota San Kevin Fiala rights to the Kings and return the Wild got Brock Faber of the Minnesota University in the first round pick 2022 is going to be the 19th overall pick. Unbelievable first mega trade. Let's diving about and talking for each players involved. Here we go. The trade between the Minnesota Wild and the Los Angeles King. Like I mentioned to you, the Kings got Kevin Fiala in return. Minnesota got the 2022 first round pick and Brock Faber. An amazing great trade. Kevin Fiala number. Kevin Fiala, uh, RFA, 25 years old, 85 point guys and 82 game with 33 goal. He was drafted in 2014 for the Nashville Predator, 11 overall pick first round. He has a contract of $5.1 million. So if you sign one year contract with the Los Angeles King, you have to approximately start around $6 million. Then the last three years, guys, 23 gold, 20 gold, 33 gold, and 28 gold per season overall. Fiala brings speed. He's great. A five versus five. Uh, Evan strength is number and that is sick are amazing. The biggest question now for the Los Angeles King is, can they sign him a long term? This is the biggest question for the King and all the fans for the Los Angeles, of course. Let's now talking about the Minnesota Wild. They got the captain of the Minnesota University, Brock Faber. He was a 45 overall pick by the, by the Minnesota Wild in 2020. He got also, he's a right defenseman. He's a six foot, 190 pounds. He played for the World Junior Championship two years ago for Team USA. And also played for Team USA at the Olympic in China in the last two seasons. He's a great leader, a great skater, a great vision. I think this is going to be a great asset a long term for the Minnesota Wild. And plus they got the Minnesota Wild, the first round pick 2022. He become the 19th overall the pick. This is a major trade, honestly, between both teams. So coach, who win that trade? At that moment, right now, I think both teams win this trade. A long term, we're going to figure out what the result of this. If the Kings find a way to sign Fiala a long term, and that's what my expectation, you're not going to give two players and return only for the right and then losing that players. I don't see this happening. So I think the King get an amazing, great winger mix who they are already. The Kings are just getting better and better with Fiala in the lineup. In return, the Minnesota Wild will have difficult time with their salary cap to controlling. With the buyout they got last season with Sutter and Parisi, they got two excellent, going to be great players for the team a long term. First of all, Brock Faber, the defenseman. And secondly, they get a 19 overall pick, where I believe they have a great defenseman, could be or an amazing forward when they're going to select a 19 pick. This is the first mega trade of season 2022. Expect more in the next couple of days. Please, before we leave, we want to invite you. Don't forget to subscribe, click on the likes, and below this video, tell me what you think about this trade. Who is the winner? Do you feel the same way like I'm thinking? Both teams win? Or do you have other opinions? I would love to hear from you. And finally, of course, you have greatness inside of you. Have an amazing, great day, everybody.